Hello, my friends, my very good friends of the internet. Today, I am starting along... Uh, sorry, let's... <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Let's play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Um, okay, so there are a few things about this Let's Play that's going to be a little bit different than the usual stuff on my channel. Firstly, uh, there's no face cam, as you can see. <laughs> Secondly, well, I don't know if you can notice, but the, the quality of the video isn't that great, but also it's not that bad at the same time either. I have spent ages uh, modifying my recording software to be able to record um, at a file size that is uh, small enough to actually upload straight from, I don't have to put it into an editing program, I can upload it straight to YouTube. Because basically I want to get these episodes out as easy as possible without having to worry about editing, stuff like that. This is a very long game. Zelda games are, well, can be very long, especially if you do all the stuff in them. And I, I just don't have the time to edit them. So basically I've set this up so it's going to record my voice and everything and I don't have to put it into an edit pro editing program. I could just pl play, record and upload and, you know, so on. So let's get into it. I I chose to do this game because I love this game. This is one of my most favorite games of all time. And I'm not even joking. I love this game. I spent my childhood playing this game and many, many other Zelda games like Ocarina of Time. Um, but this game is one of my favorites and always will be. It'll always have a special place in my heart and it's a lot of inspiration. A lot of the stuff I do like when I... Oh crap, not jo Jossie. Uh, how do I go back? Uh... There we go. A lot of the inspiration for stuff like when I make games comes from this game. Oh, I love it. So we're going to get straight into it. It's going to be friggin' sweet. And we are going to start. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Let's just go. Uh, in the land of Hyrule, there echoes a legend. A legend de oh, I never gets, lets you read it long enough. But damn, I'm, I'm so excited about playing this game. If it was any other game that I'd never played before, there'd be no way I'd do a Let's Play on this. But I just, I love it so much and I've got to do a Let's Play. Um, I recently bought this on, I've got a Wii U. Um, and uh, I bought it on the Virtual Console. And I was planning to play it on that. And because I just, there's something amazing about consoles where I just... Because I'm playing this right now, the the footage you're seeing is from an emulator on my PC because it's it's the easiest way for me to record it. I don't have a capture card for my Wii U and stuff like that. But I just there's something so magical about playing something on a console because they're I don't know an emulation. I feel like I'm cheating in a way. Um, well, the the resolution obviously is higher uh, than it would be on the console. The console resolution is I think it was like 640 by 480 where where there's this. I'm playing this in 1080p, but it's the recording is downscaled to 720p, so it's obviously a resolution's a lot better. I had the choice of making this widescreen, stretching it, but I've decided to go with the original 4x3 ratio, which is why to the left and right of the screen, as you can see, there are black borders, which looks pretty, I don't know, but pretty not great. But I just, I just wanted it the original way and everything, so I decided to do it this route. But I seriously was considering getting a capture card just to record... <laughs> Uh, it, so I could play it on the console because I just there's something so cool about the console Playing it on a console But I know anyway, let's get into the actual game. So um, basically Link's just been knocked off his horse and who the heck is this guy? Some freaking weird dude with a mask. He's he's knocked us out Damn it. Tee you fairies did great. I wonder if he has anything good on him. Huh this guy? Well, that shouldn't be a problem or should it? This Let's Play could it could span to like 100 episodes or so. But that's okay because literally I don't have to edit any of this. I just upload it straight to YouTube. Um, and I know, uh, you know, because I, I love to, I love putting good quality in my videos on YouTube. I, all, I take pride in that. But with a game like this, I just have to try the easiest route possible. So I can play this and enjoy it at the same time as recording it. Because if I have to worry about, say if I was doing my face cam, I'd have to worry about the battery life and I'd have to... Um, uh, I just oh, it can be so complicated sometimes, but with this it's really simple. I can just be relaxed and laid back, and so this is going to be quite a different let's play on my channel compared to what you guys might be used to. It might be a bit more laid back because there's no editing and stuff like that. But anyway, yeah. So oh, Link's woken up. He, this dude stole our ocarina. What a jerk! You're going down, bro. He's woken up. You going? You going die? Yeah, you better hide that. And BAM! No, he stole our horse! Damn you! You've stolen a pona! You freaking jerk! 
Damn skull kid. Dun 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 So I haven't figured out the, an upload schedule for this game, but I'm thinking to myself, I just... Because I don't want to bombard my channel with these videos because they're not the best in quality. I don't think a lot of people are, is gonna are going to watch this series, to be honest. I only think a few people are going to watch that, and it's totally fine, to be honest with me, because I just want to enjoy it. And if there are a few people along for the ride with this, then I, I'm so grateful that you guys are going to sit and watch me play this game. Um, so if you, if you, if you watch every episode of this, then thank you so much, because I just, I really appreciate that. I really don't think this is going to get a lot of views, uh, but I'm totally cool with that. I just want to play the game and enjoy it. So, right, we have to, how the heck did that guy get the hit, my horse up here? Seriously, this is crazy. Doing all these cool jumps and stuff. Dun, dun, dun. And now we have a cutscene. That's the thing about Zelda games. The intros are always have long cutscenes. It's really annoying. But in the, in the latest ones, they've allowed you to skip them and stuff, which is cool. Ooh, spooky. It's funny, like, because there's, there's tons of theories about this game, and one theory is, at that point, Link falls to his death and he dies, and all of this game is a dream, or, like, is the afterlife or something like that. I don't believe that at all. There's loads of flaws in that theory. Just just so you guys know, as I said, this is, like, my most favorite game of all time. I'm a huge Zelda fan, so I'm going to be mentioning a lot of stuff that would may reference other Zelda games. So if you're not a Zelda fan, you may not get it. But if you are a Zelda fan, then that's great! <laughs> Duh, duh, duh. Literally, I would spend so long of my childhood with my N6, with my N64, playing this game in my room when I was like seven years old. Oh, so good! And Ocarina of Time as well. Actually, I had Ocarina of Time first, um, but this game, man, because at first I didn't have this game. I didn't own it. I had Ocarina of Time, but I didn't own this game. And I played it at my mates. And I was like, wow, this is so cool! Wow. And then eventually I, I, I was able to rent it from Blockbuster. Um, and I was like, wow, this is amazing. And I only had it for like two days. And then I was like, oh, I've got to rent it again. I've got to rent it again. Like nowadays, I'm an adult. I can just buy a game. Like, oh, I'll have that game or whatever, you know. But back then it was like, oh, I can only rent this like say once a month. And I've got it for like two days. It was just such a special thing, you know. I think there is a way actually to record face cam with this without it being a lot of effort. Because I think Bandicam, I've, I've got a, uh, I have a webcam, it's, it's not as good quality as the one that you guys may be used to, but I have a webcam that I can set up that will automatically record to this video without me having to edit also, so I could do that. But I, th I thought for the time being, just to make it more chilled, I'm just going to do voice. But write in the comments if you want to, you know, um, hear my, uh, see my face or whatever, I don't know. But at the moment, I'm fine with my voice, just voicing. Damn you! So basically, this jerk has just turned me into a Deku scrub. What a jerk. I'm stuck like this now. I'm not human anymore. I'm this freaking thing, and it's really annoying. We have to figure out a way how to turn back to human. Oh, but you've left your fairy dude behind. It's funny, but oh, both of those uh, fairies are called Tattle and Tail. It's like a funny play on Tattle Tail. The thingy majiggy. If it wasn't for dealing with you, I would, I would, wouldn't have got separated from my brother. Well, don't just sit there, Deku boy. Do something. Well, she's got a mouth. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? Is there something stuck on my face? Will you stop staring at me and just open that door for me? Please, come on. I'm a helpless little girl asking you. So hurry up. Wow, so demanding. Your life is in my hands, fairy. Okay, so when we're uh, this Deku do, we can do this cool spin thing, which is cool. That's like his attack or whatever. I always found it funny in Zelda games, like, when you roll, the button, as it says on the top, on the blue thing, it says attack. But it's not attack. Oh, it's spin here, which I suppose is attack, but it's it's rolling with the link. It's really weird. Anyway, I mean, when I first played this, it was so confusing. Because I was like, what do I do? Is there a button? Well, how do I open this door? And then I, I didn't realize that you could just go up to it and go, boop. Because, like, how would that even happen? It doesn't make any sense. But whatever. I think also for the the, the file size of the video, because I'm, I'm uploading these straight to YouTube, I've decided 
The episodes are going to be between 10 and 15 minutes long. Um, because obviously there's no editing, there's no compression. It's literally recorded, then I upload it. Uh, to save time. So, I was going to go for 10 minutes, but I thought 10 minutes is too short. I used to do 10 minute let play let's plays. So I think 15 minutes is reasonable. 20 minutes is around, is around the standard these days for let's plays, I think. But I'm going to do 10, between 10 and 15 minutes. Okay, so you can do this cool thing where you've got these flowers and you can go whoop and fly out and then fly away. Fly away. Cool. Open the door. Okay. Let's move along to this one. So this game was... Um, it was uh, remastered for the 3DS. I don't know if any of you guys know. If you've got a 3DS, you should get it. It's Majora's Mask 3D. It's amazing. Um, I highly recommend you get it. Um, it's it's a really good remaster. And I really wish they'd bring it to like the Virtual Console on the Wii U or something, because I'd totally buy it. Um, the graphics are a lot better. Um... It runs at a faster frame rate. There's, there's, it, there's some bits that have made it a little bit easier because modern games are usually a lot easier than they used to be. Um, but yeah, it's definitely worth a look. But yeah, so I actually had a 3DS and I had that game and I had Ocarina of Time 3D and all that. Um, but I sold it a few months back. Um, mostly because I didn't play it that much anymore, my 3DS. And I just bought the HTC Vive. And I said to myself, if I get the Vive... Um, I've got to sell something because it's the Vive is like $800 and I thought I can't have that and a 3DS or whatever so I got rid of the 3DS but I feel like getting it back, getting it back now I don't know I, I just miss it I don't know okay so where the heck are we now this is weird oh gosh look there's like we're in this weird clock tower thing is it I don't know some cool music playing are we still in Hyrule what's going on I don't know Let's get out of here. Oh, wait, what? You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? Who the heck is that? Hide very quick. <laughs> I own the Happy Mass Shop. The Happy Mass Shop is a shop in Hyrule in Ocarina of Time, and this guy is from Ocarina of Time too. in case you didn't know. I travel far and wide in search of masks. During my travels, a very important mask was stolen by, by an imp in the woods. Hmm, I wonder who that was. So here I am at a loss, and now I've found you. Oh, that's nice. Now, don't think me rude, but I've been following you. Well, that's a bit creepy. That's not rude. That's just creepy, bro. For I know uh, I know a way to return you to your former self. Yes, we can be human again. Hooray! Uh, if you can get back the precious item that was stolen from you, I will return you to normal. So if I get, if I get my, back my ocarina, which he stole from me, he can turn me back to normal. Or does he mean my, mean my horse? Because my horse was stolen as well. I don't know. In exchange, all I ask is that you get the precious mask that was from the imp stole from me. <laughs> what? It's not a simple task. Why someone? Why to someone like you? It should. Uh, it should by no means be a difficult task. I wonder if he recognizes me from Majora's Mask. I don't know. Except the one thing is, I'm a very busy fellow, and I must leave this place in three days. Emphasis on the three days. How grateful I would be if you could bring back the mask, uh, if you could bring bring it back to me before my time is up here. Time plays a huge element in this game, guys. This game is all about time. Time is the main key to this game, I'll just say now. But yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous courage. I'm sure you'll find it, find it right away. Yeah, right. <laughs> well then, I'm counting on you. Cool, let's tread into the land then. Oh, maybe not that way. Up here. Yeah, that's it, mate. Well done. And through the door. There we go. Yeah. Dawn of the first day. 72 hours remain. <laughs> South Clock Town. Oh, where are we? Clock Town. I've never seen this place before. Where are we, dude? What is going on? He gives us the creeps. He gives me the creeps. That mask salesman was the... Oh, sorry, just thinking aloud. But three days, even if we sleep, that only leaves us with a measly 72 hours. Talk about demanding. Well, don't just stand stand there. We're going to see the Great Fairy. Look, you want to find Skullkid, don't you? The Great Fairy will know what he's up to. She watches over everything. 
And just between you and me, the Skull Kid is no match for the Great Fairy. Go to the shrine near the North Gate and you'll find the Great Fairy there. Woo! Cool! But I think, my friends, I'm going to end the episode here because I'm going to just check the recording's all okay, everything, and I'm going to get a coffee, and I'm going to be right back with part two, whenever that is, guys. So thanks so much for watching, and I hope you guys watch this, the rest of this series and enjoy it because um, I'm going to have so much fun playing it. Um, yeah, and I'll see you in the next Majora's Mask video. Peace out, guys.